Greetings and welcome to another episode of Trippy Food and another installment of Goodbye Mr. Chips. Today we're trying Pringles again. And I know Pringles usually disappoints. However, the last time we tried a Pringles Wendy's uh, Pringles, uh, we were not disappointed because it was the Baconator and actually did a pretty good job of that. So I'm hoping that they do a pretty good job with this. Uh, this is nat naturally and artificially flavored, and there is a picture of Wendy's spicy chicken sandwich. Wendy's spicy chicken sandwich is actually pretty good; it holds up uh, well against Popeyes. And um, and so you know, I'm kind of looking forward to it. Now the ingredients are a little bit disappointing: dried potatoes, vegetable oil, sunflower oil, corn flour. Um, I mean, there's onion powder, spices. There's no chicken, right? So. So they're going for the spicy chicken flavor, but no chicken. Mm, hopefully it'll be good. Well, the one thing that's interesting about this, whenever they do something with Wendy's, they have that Wendy's icon or a Wendy's picture on the top where usually it's a picture of uh, Julius Pringle. But in, in this case, it's Wendy or young Wendy. And it looks like there's some sort of contest here as well. Special Wendy's offer, download the Wendy's cup. Oh, Wendy's app, I'm sorry. Um, enter the code under this lid. So I don't know what's gonna happen, but Let's go ahead and open this up, see what this is all about. Oh, there is a code under the lid. Maybe we win something, who knows? We'll have to check that out. It doesn't smell like chicken. It doesn't smell like a sandwich. And it doesn't smell spicy. Let's see what this is all about. All right, here we go. Can't eat just one of them. You have to put them two together. See, can I do the duck lips thing? When it says spices, it doesn't say what spices. It is spicy. It's spicier than most Pringles or other things that say they're spicy are. It's not discernible, I can't say, you know, it tastes like jalapeno or sriracha, really hard to say. But it, they are pretty spicy. Maybe because there's wheat flour in there, they're expecting that to substitute for the bun. They're slightly savory, but not enough to suggest chicken. What they taste like, they taste like the breading, you know, for the for the chicken sandwich. It tastes like the breading on the chicken sandwich, but not the chicken itself. And it doesn't taste like anything else part of that chicken sandwich. Maybe the bun, the bun and the breading. That's about it. It's not bad. It's also not great. If you're gonna say spicy chicken sandwich, try to make it taste like chicken. Try to make it you know, more savory. Those chicken and a biscuit crackers that they sell. I mean, those, those have that the hint of chicken or that, the idea of chicken without necessarily having uh, chicken flavor and everything. They could have done better on that. I think they should, they should have kind of stepped it up to give, they, at least give you the hint of chicken and they did not do that. So um, normally, because they're not bad, I would give them a thumbs in the middle, but because they're supposed to taste like the Wendy's spicy chicken sandwich, I'm gonna give it a thumbs down because they fail miserably. So a little bit disappointed in you. Um, they are spicier than most other Pringles, which is why Julius Pringle is, is like crying and sweating on the outside. But um, I don't know. Uh, I, I think not enough to make me go, whoa, Wendy's, you hit this one out of the park, tastes like a, or reminds me of a Wendy's spicy chicken sandwich. It does not. So unfortunately, if you want to go out and give it a try, I would go soon. I think they have it at uh, like CBS Walmarts. They might have it there. I have not seen this in um, I have not seen this in like regular grocery stores. But uh, but go out and try it. It is limited time only. Uh, go out and try it if you get a chance and see what you think and leave a comment down below. Let me know if you get a different experience than I do. But if you go out there, be careful because it's crazy out there. So please take care of yourselves. Please take care of others, and we'll see you soon. Bye. 
Thanks for checking out Trippy Food. If you enjoyed watching that video half as much as I did making it, well then I enjoyed it twice as much as you did. And if that's the case, you'll probably like this video right here. And if not, check out this video right here. That one's a little bit different. Either way, leave a comment down below. And be sure to subscribe by clicking on the Trippy Food icon right here. Glad you could make it, and we hope to see you again soon.